Defense Research and Development Organization DRDO has played a key role in empowering India by developing state-of-the-art defense technologies. The organization is constantly striving to make the country self-reliant in critical defense technologies and systems. this series, now, DRDO and All India Council for Technical Education have started an M-Tech program in defense technology. On July the 8th, this unique program was launched through a virtual program organized by AICTE. Now, this program can also be made available in institutes, universities, IITs, NITs and private engineering institutes affiliated to AICTE. This new field will motivate aspiring engineers to start their career in defense technology. We have 1,000 odd universities, you know, around 10,000 technical institutions, another 40,000 arts, commerce, science colleges, and nowhere there is any defense technology being taught. So we decided we must create a curriculum, we must provide support for our faculty to teach these courses and that's how DRDO AICT came together and we signed an MOU. Just recently we, we had launch of uh, six new programs in defense technology and these are all very very important for armed forces be it uh, army, navy and air force. We joined together, the curriculum was re revised and then we have given six different M-Tech programs and many institutions are now coming forward to adopt them and then start M-Tech programs. Currently, six special streams have been kept under this course, which include areas like combat technology, aeronautics technology, naval technology, communication systems and sensors, directed energy and high energy materials technology. The M-Tech program in defense technology will enable the students to work in the defense industry and also prepare them at par with the public sector undertakings and private companies. DRDO's laboratories spread across the country, work in areas such as aeronautics, armament, electronics, combat vehicles, engineering systems, instrumentation, missiles, advanced computing and simulation, special materials, naval systems, life sciences, information and communication systems for the defense sector. This network of DRDO laboratories will provide an opportunity to the students to engage with real research and development work. The MTech course has been designed to produce postgraduates who will have the necessary theoretical and experimental knowledge, skill and aptitude in various areas related to defense technology. Engineering graduates will be able to apply for this course. The course will be made available in both online and offline formats in various scientific and educational institutions of the country. आज एमटेक प्रोग्राम में हमें जो जिस तरह के चैलेंज आते हैं इंडस्ट्रीज ये कहती है कि आपने दो साल एमटेक तो जो है कराया लेकिन अभी भी जिस तरह की नई टेक्नोलॉजीज हमें डेवलप करनी पड़ रही है करनी होती है या जो एमटेक का बच्चा हमारा टीचर बनता है उसके अंदर उस लेवल की अभी भी कैपेबिलिटीज नहीं होती है जो बच्चों के साथ भी न्याय कर सके या इंडस्ट्री में जाके इमीडिएटली काम करना शुरू कर दे तो ये सबसे इस तरह की बड़ी शुरुआत है कि उनकी जो अपेक्षाएं हैं डीआरडीओ की उनके जो जो डेवलपमेंट के काम चल रहे हैं रिसर्च के काम चल रहे हैं उसमें पहले दिन से ही उनकी सहभागिता हो जाएगी और क्वालिटी स्टूडेंट्स हम जो है उनको देंगे और ये तो सिर्फ छः एरियाज ही हैं और बावन लेबोरेटरी जो देश में जिस देश में डी के उनका करीब करीब स्पेशलाइजेशन अलग अलग है हो सकता है आने वाले टाइम में हम इसको एक्सपांड करें और हर एरिया के लिए बच्चे हम जो है उनको देंगे द कोर्स विल गिव स्टूडेंट्स वैल्यूबल एक्सपोजर एंड इक्विप दम विद नॉलेज अबाउट वेर स्टेट ऑफ दी आर डिफेंस सिस्टम एंड कंटेम्प्ररी टेक्नोलॉजीज The students will also be able to conduct their main thesis work in DRDO labs, defense PSUs and private defense sector companies. So far, the engineering education in the country has had very limited scope for imparting knowledge related to defense and security applications and there has been a direct shortage of educated and trained human resource in this sector. 
the collaborative effort of DRDO and AICTE will generate opportunities for employment, set up new startups in the defense sector and produce a large pool of skilled and experienced workforce. This effort will also strengthen India's self-reliance in defense sector.